Besides being two of the most famous athletes in the world in their respective sports, The Rock and Usain Bolt are two magnates who know how to enjoy their immense fortunes. But have you ever stopped to think about who lives the more luxurious life? In this video, you'll watch a fierce battle between The Rock and Usain Bolt. Both athletes live comfortably in beautiful properties, but who owns the most valuable home? Usain Bolt, for example, currently lives in a mansion in Norbrook Terrace in Kingston, the capital of Jamaica. There are very few records about the athlete's property, but according to some sources, the house is worth $2,650,000. The Rock, on the other hand, owns a luxurious mansion situated on 3.67 acres in Beverly Hills, California. Although there are few records of the interior of the property, it is possible to see that Dwayne Johnson's property can offer a lot of privacy, leisure, and comfort for him. Resembling almost a resort, the mansion has several amenities such as a large green space, a cinema room with comfortable armchairs, a tennis court, a recreation area with a swimming pool, and even another heated swimming pool that is fully covered. And to acquire this Mediterranean-style mansion, the star had to spend a real fortune, According to some sources, The Rock had to pay the princely sum of $27.8 million. So, The Rock easily wins this round. Both businessmen love to enjoy beautiful car models in their daily lives, but which one spends more money on luxury cars? Usain Bolt, for example, has been seen with several vehicles, such as $30,000 Mini Cooper, Toyota Tundra, $35,000, $40,000 Jeep Wrangler, $70,000 Range Rover, $75,000 BMW M3, $95,000 Cadillac Escalade. His most famous car is his gold-colored Nissan GTR, a vehicle he has posted several pictures of on Instagram, which is priced at around $115,000. Even more expensive, he has also been seen with a Ferrari California a beautiful sports car that attracts a lot of attention wherever it goes, with an estimated price of $150,000. He has also taken pictures with a Ferrari F430, one of the most famous and requested Ferrari models. And although it hasn't been manufactured since 2009, its price is still quite steep, being found at around $150,000. Another Nissan that Usain Bolt has seen is the GTR Nismo model, an even more powerful and luxurious vehicle that can cost upwards of $200,000. Bolt has also been seen near a Ferrari 599 GTB Fiorano, another sports car from the famous Italian luxury sports car manufacturer. This Ferrari model is equipped with a powerful V12 engine, which makes it one of the fastest cars of the brand. And it's no wonder that its price is estimated at over $250,000. Even more expensive, the Sprinter has also posed in front of a Ferrari 458 Italia, a beautiful car capable of attracting a lot of attention wherever it passes, being a huge icon from Ferrari. And to own this amazing car, you may have to fork out around $280,000. And he has even been seen driving a McLaren 720s, a beautiful sports car made for those who like speed. The vehicle is equipped with a powerful V8 engine capable of accelerating from 0 to 60 miles per hour in an unbelievable 2.8 seconds. And to enjoy all this power, you have to fork out some serious cash. The newest models of this vehicle are estimated to cost around $300,000. The most luxurious vehicle Usain Bolt has ever been seen using is a Rolls-Royce Cullinan, a super-luxury SUV from the famous Rolls-Royce luxury car brand. The interior of the vehicle is very sophisticated, offering refinement and comfort for all its passengers. And to enjoy all this luxury, it is estimated that this vehicle can cost upwards of $350,000. The Rock for his part has been seen with several impressive cars, such as $35,000 Plymouth Prowler, $55,000 1971 Chevy Chevelle, $75,000 Ford F-150, $80,000 Jaguar F-Type $105,000 Cadillac Escalade $110,000 Range Rover Sport $120,000 1969 Chevrolet Camaro $130,000 BMW i8 $140,000 Porsche Taycan $145,000 Porsche Panamera $150,000 Aston Martin Vantage $180,000 McLaren 650s, $210,000 Aston Martin DB9, 
$220,000 Bentley Continental GT $250,000 Ferrari 458 $300,000 Lamborghini Huracan $310,000 Ferrari F12 Berlinetta $340,000 Rolls-Royce Cullinan $350,000 Rolls-Royce Wraith $450,000 Lamborghini Aventador $500,000 Ford GT660 Already in the millions, he has been seen with a McLaren P1, a super sports car capable of attracting a lot of attention wherever it goes, whose price of the latest models can easily exceed the figure of $1.2 million. Even more expensive, Dwayne Johnson has already taken a picture with a Ferrari LaFerrari, a stunning vehicle with a modern and futuristic design, capable of charming anyone who likes sports cars. And it's no wonder that to have this incredible vehicle in your garage, you may have to spend a real fortune, and it can be found for more than $1.4 million. The most expensive car The Rock has ever seen was a beautiful Pagani Huayra, a sports car coveted by many car lovers. The sports car has a modern design with an impeccable finish, and if the actor has this car, he may have shelled out more than $2.6 million. And since The Rock has a more luxurious garage, he wins this round point for him. Both athletes love to travel in maximum comfort, but who has access to more luxurious means of transportation? The Rock has already been seen in a Gulfstream G650, one of the most modern, fastest, and longest flying range aircraft available on the market in this segment. The interior of the plane is luxuriously finished and can carry up to 18 people with great ergonomics. And although we do not know if he owns this little jet, it is estimated that to rent it you have to pay about $15,000 per flight hour. When it is time to travel to different places in the world, Usain Bolt always shares his trips in private jets on social media. One of the aircraft he uses is the Gulfstream G400, a sophisticated twin-engine, high-performance business aircraft of medium size and intercontinental range, with the capacity to carry up to 20 passengers very comfortably. This aircraft is one of the most modern that exists for private use, with a range of almost 4,500 miles, being able to travel long distances without the need to stop for fuel. And to enjoy all this luxury, you may have to fork out more than $10,000 for each hour of flight. In his spare time, Usain Bolt likes to enjoy life aboard beautiful yachts. One of the boats that the Jamaican has already been seen using was the one known as Misdirection, a 108 feet long yacht capable of offering a lot of comfort and fun for everyone who goes aboard. The interior of the ship is very spacious and elegant, with five cabins that can accommodate up to 10 people. And to enjoy a yacht of that size, there is no doubt that it is not cheap at all. To get an idea of the price, this boat was put up for sale for about $2 million, but it is very likely that Usain Bolt rented it, paying around $50,000 for a week. And since neither of them owns the means of transportation, we'll consider this round a tie. Point for both! The two sports celebrities have lived in many places, but who owns the more valuable real estate portfolio? Starting with the Jamaican star! Another property that Usain Bolt used to live in was in a luxurious penthouse in the exclusive Araluan building, located in Pont Frederick in the Australian state of New South Wales. Known as the Sky House, the unit exudes elegance in every architectural detail, containing spacious and well-lit rooms, thanks to the glass walls and windows that bring natural light into the interior on a daily basis. Plus, it has great finishes for a big star like Usain Bolt to live in. The main living room has an open layout and features a large TV in the center, while the clean design kitchen features stone countertops, modern appliances for meal preparation, and integrates a family environment. The dining room has a wooden table for eight people and a glass door that leads to the outdoor patio. The penthouse also includes other living areas to pass the time, one of which has a very discreet modern fireplace. Moving on to the master bedroom, there are more glass walls that leave the place well lit and a luxurious private bathroom included. Besides this bedroom, the apartment still has three others, which leave nothing to be desired, as they have graceful aspects for everyone's comfort. The penthouse also has another three stunning bathrooms, as well as another living room that leads to the outdoor patio for entertainment, where there is a well-kept lawn for leisure time, and a shaded hut, which is ideal for resting while contemplating the privileged views to Brisbane water. This is all capable of offering a lot of tranquility, and this is the perfect place to casually gather with friends and family. 
The outdoor space also includes several trees and gardens that ensure privacy for the residents and also has a spa tub, a casual dining area, and an extra guest facility containing a beautiful bedroom, an elegant bathroom, and a small dining room, which also features beautiful scenery of the region. According to media reports, Usain Bolt rented the 11,000-square-foot penthouse for 13 weeks in 2018 for the price of $17,400. At the time he left the place, the unit was valued at $1,900,000, but was later sold for $2,800,000. The Rock, on the other hand, purchased a 13,000-square-foot mansion in a gated community in Miami, Florida, in 2012. Going inside the property, we can see that the decor has a classic style with very sophisticated furniture. According to the photos that were released in the media, the mansion has a cinema room for the actor to watch his movies, as well as six beautiful and spacious bedrooms and seven bathrooms, some of which are very luxurious. In the external area, there is a lot of space with very green grass and a beautiful swimming pool with a jacuzzi. And to live in this big house, some sources estimate that the actor paid around $3.5 million at the time. When Dwayne Johnson wants to have more tranquility and contact with nature, he can enjoy his amazing 46-acre farm in Powder Springs. Entering the property of the actor, we can see how well cared for and beautiful his farm is, with an extensive green lawn, an ideal place for those who enjoy contact with nature. There is, for example, a large private lake, a place where The Rock has already posted on social networks that he likes to practice fishing and have a lot of fun with his daughters. The main farmhouse, which was built in 2002, has French Provencal architecture and has almost 15,000 square feet of floor space. Its interior has a rustic design, with a strong presence of walnut wood and stone cladding, as well as high ceilings and good natural light, reminiscent of old historic mansions. The mansion has eight bedrooms and nine bathrooms, some of which are very large and luxurious. In the backyard of the property, there is a good recreation area with a barbecue and a beautiful round swimming pool with a whirlpool. But no doubt it is the outside of the property that is most impressive, with a large area of pasture and of course a barn with 12 stables for the property's horses. And for when the actor wants to have fun with his animals, there is a spacious sand track for horses. As reported in the media, Dwayne Johnson needed to spend about $9.5 million. Considering that The Rock has a more valuable real estate portfolio, he wins this round. Point for him! Both athletes are also big businessmen, but who has the more lucrative sources of income? The Rock, for example. One of his ventures is his production company called Seven Bucks Productions, which has released several successful films starring him, such as Rampage, Jumanji, The Next Level, Hobbs and Shaw, Red Notice, among others. However, in the fitness business, Dwayne launched Athletico in 2019, a mega event with talks focused on athletics and well-being. He has also released his own app called The Rock Clock, which features a motivational alarm clock and goal plan for those who are looking to improve their physique. On the other hand, in the American football universe, it was announced in the media that The Rock and other partners have acquired the XFL Professional League for $15 million. Dwayne Johnson also has investments in the beverage business, being for example one of the partners of Zoa Energy, an energy drink made for those who need more energy. In addition, one of the actor's biggest businesses is his stake in the tequila brand Terramana, which has been very successful with the public and is projected to be worth billions of dollars in the coming years. And social media is where Johnson does a lot of the publicizing for his companies. On YouTube, for example, he has over 6 million subscribers, and he makes use of this audience to make money by boosting the sale of his products. On Instagram, it's no different, because he is one of the most followed celebrities in the world, with around 350 million people and potential customers. But he also takes advantage of his fame to advertise for other companies, such as Apple, Voss, Under Armour, among many others. To get an idea of figures, it is estimated that the actor's 2017 partnership with automaker Ford alone earned him around $15 million a year. But his biggest advertising contract is estimated to be with sporting goods brand Under Armour, with some sources estimating that the actor receives around $25 million a year from it. Usain Bolt for his part, since 2019 he has been working as a music producer, participating in several music videos that are posted on his YouTube channel. 
Another source of his income is as a writer, having already released his own biography, as well as a bibliographical film. As an entrepreneur, Usain Bolt also stands out, owning a chain of restaurants in Jamaica called Tracks and Records. The decoration of the place is all inspired by Bolt's achievements, which should attract many fans in order to visit the place. To get an idea of the success that the restaurant has in its country, the company's Instagram alone has over 50,000 followers. Back in 2016, Bolt launched Champion Shav, a line of high-quality, affordable shaving razors. But the athlete's biggest venture is Bolt Mobility, a company that operates over 5,000 electric scooters based in Miami Beach. And as reported in the press, in 2020 the company received some $30 million in order to make new investments. But without a doubt, his biggest source of income comes through his fame. This is because Usain Bolt is known worldwide as the fastest person in the world, which attracts many companies interested in sponsoring him. Among the brands that have already invested in the athlete's image are Gatorade, Hublet, Puma, Visa, and many others. And with so many sources of income, we can say that besides being an athlete, Usain Bolt is also a businessman. And since we don't know exactly how much they earn from each venture, point for both. There's no doubt that these two sports celebrities have accumulated great fortunes. But who is the richer and more successful of the two? To get an idea of Usain Bolt's income, just for competing in track and field events, it is estimated that he earned around $250,000 per event, which could total around $1 million per year. And although this is a good source of money, it is far from all the cash he makes, since he gets much more money off the track than actually racing. And the reason for this is that Usain Bolt has become a major marketing symbol, with dozens of companies willing to pay millions of dollars to associate their products with him. His main and biggest advertising contract is with Puma, a sporting goods company that pays him around $10 million per year to be a brand ambassador. And it's no wonder that in 2018, Bolt made it onto the Forbes list of the world's highest paid athletes, earning an amount of approximately $31 million that year. Today, after he has retired, he continues to make a lot of money by maintaining his advertising contracts. And perhaps this is why some sources estimate that Usain Bolt has a net worth of approximately $100 million. The Rock, in turn, is considered one of the most successful actors in the world. In his prime wrestling in WWE, The Rock's salary reached the million-dollar figures, with sources estimating that he'd even made around $5 million a year. But it was as a Hollywood movie actor that Dwayne Johnson really made his money. To get a sense of figures, it is estimated that he received about $5,500,000 for the Scorpion King, $9 million for the other guys, $10 million for Fast and Furious 6, $12,500,000 for the rundown, $14 million for Central Intelligence, $15 million for Furious 7, $20 million for Hercules, $22,500,000 for Black Adam, $23,500,000 for Red Notice, and some $25 million for San Andreas. And it's no wonder that The Rock has been considered the highest paid actor in the world multiple times, with his peak being in 2018 when it was estimated that he was paid around $124 million for the year, becoming the highest paid actor of all time. And while no one knows exactly how wealthy The Rock is, many sources estimate that Dwayne Johnson has a net worth of approximately $800 million. It's clear that The Rock wins this round. Point for him! At the end of this battle, we have two points for Usain Bolt against six points for The Rock, making him the winner of this competition. But if you believe there are other arguments to defend either of them, write your best justification below. Hey! You like the video? So don't forget about leave your like and comment, and tell some suggestions of another videos, and hopefully we gonna do it. All about channel, deals to satisfy your curiosity.